Hello and welcome back to No Man's Sky, everybody. Lon Paul here, and we are doing the permadeath, no, st no starter ship. I almost did that. And permadeath run here to the center of the galaxy. So um, this is the story mode playthrough. Right now we are doing the They Who Returned. I wanted to get this done and kind of over with so we can get access to a whole bunch of other things. Uh, especially right now, I want to see if I can't find another ship. This hunter ship is great, but the ships on this planet are pretty cool. So I wanted to see if I couldn't follow through on that. Look at what's going on with the animals. There's some kind of graphic issue going on. That was pretty cool. I'm going to take another look at that. Plus, I got a couple cheerleaders here. Hey, how you doing? Good to see you. We are, you see, if you hear all those explosions and stuff, you'll see that this is just what's going on right here. We just have that uh, volcano kept erupting in the background. No big deal there. No, looks like the graphic issue disappeared. I don't know what that was. It was kind of a blur image. Really, really strange. So we got to head over to this harmonic camp and get some, some things done. Uh, these guys are just being friendly at the moment. Nothing going on. Nothing to see here, right? So I'm just going to go ahead and gather up some of these resources real quick because it's always nice to have them. Um, you never know what you might get out of these things just to play it safe. Who knows? Microprocessor would be great. Eh, Corvax casing, whatever. So let's go ahead and jump on the ship. We're going to go ahead and uh, check those things out. We just see where the camp is real quick. How far away was it? 14 hours. Yeah, I don't think we're going to walk it. So let's go ahead and take off. Again, we're going to be looking for a ship. We want to get an Atlantid multi-tool as well. Uh, we, we got some things we want to get done here, so we're going to be looking forward to that. So that's what we're going to do with this particular episode. Okay. Let's go ahead and head to the harmonic camp, and right after we do this, this particular uh, mini mission here, we're going to go ahead and check out some other stuff. So let's see what this harmonic camp is all about. I believe it's one of the usual camps for this. Let me see here. Um, is it in a exact location? Let's see. Hold on. Uh, it looks like it's down here. I thought it was up here. Ah, yeah. Okay. It's one of these camps. All right. All right. So we're good. Down we go. All right. And we appear inside that. Okay. And as usual, as you can see, this is the camp we went to earlier. Weren't really impressed with this multi-tool, so we didn't even bother with it. So let's go back over to this autophage here. And see what it has to say this time. Language. Something, something. Modules 10, 16, 6. We're going to touch the head. And it looks like we have to repair. Okay, with appropriate glyph. Okay, let's hold on. Let's back up. Modules 10, 16, 6. So that's what it needs. Okay, right, right, right. I gotcha. Uh, let's go ahead and do 6. Uh, 10, and then 16. There we go. Translation module defragmented. Hello, pre-built entity. Thank you for your for the assistance. I am autophage. No idea. H94. I have been positioned here to interface with pre-built entities. How did you discover this camp? Uh, let's see. Confront about the hijack. Introduce myself. Ask about pre-built entity. Introduce myself. I'll be polite. Fascinating. We do not frequently welcome visitors. It has been 3,984 years since our last. Wow. It is interesting to hear your introduction. I am an autophage. We are unlike the other electronic life forms you may know. We do not possess the arrogance of the Corvax. Your kind is neither less nor more than mine. You simply are. We're going to confront about the hijack. Ah, I see. That was you. They had a silent moment. When they speak again, they sound almost embarrassed. I apologize, prebuilt entity. This was my own error. An accident. There are starships out there who are more than metal shells. Alive, but not free enslaved to a hive mind. We intend only to liberate the imprisoned. We intend no harm upon independent pilots. I ask about pre-built entity. You are biological. The growth of your shell was automated, I believe. You did not salvage your own limbs. Your tissue and your sinew grew in parallel with your mind. There are many like you. Most of the universe is pre-built, and you... Autophage UH-94 stops abruptly, cutting themselves off mid-sentence. I can hear their co uh, cogitation. 
they, uh, pardon me, the turning of rusty gear in against rusty gear. Something intrigues me, prevailed entity. I made an error with your ship. I do not frequently make errors. I probed for the three dominant life form patterns. There was no match. The starship appeared unpiloted. What manner of life form are you? I am a traveler. Traveler? Yes, I know this term. I am generating a theory. Tell me, prevailed traveler entity, you possess a starship, therefore, this is not the first planet you have seen, correct? Confirm. The starship traverses one side of the universe, material, matter, physics, but my theory concerns the other side, the other method of travel. There is something. I detected in your shell an echo of void. I theorize you must have existed there transitionally. You must have entered the portals. Confirm. Yes, this aligns. You carry something in your shell, as we do. It is evident. You were foretold. The Disruptor. Ah, okay, so now I'm understanding a little bit better. I remember going through this when it first came out a few months ago, but I have literally forgotten how this worked. So, here we go. The word lingers in the air a moment, but before I can interject, Autophage UH-94 continues. I extend a challenge, Disruptor. Let us test my theory. I will inform the other Autophage of your coming. To perceive them, your scanner will require an extension. I will provide the schematic, but you must build it with your own hands. Consider this a ritual of introduction. Scan Harmonizer. Look at that. It looks like I have everything. I happen to have runaway mold on me, too, by accident. Isn't that interesting? Let's go to my inventory real quick. So we see I have all this runaway mold we've been using, right? But we have to put it on our multi-tool. Now this right now is my main multi-tool. So we're going to go ahead and add it in here. It goes with the scanner, uh, which is over here. Uh, let's see, right here. So we'll go ahead and add this in. And it is now part of my tool. There we go. Okay. While we're here. Uh, let's see, let's use you. Okay. All right. Return to harmonic camp and sweep. This is the harmonic camp, right? Okay. Whoa. Dude. A dude appeared. Let's go talk to dude. Hello, dude. Welcome, prebuilt entity. I'm assuming you are the disruptor. Ask about the harmonic camp. Uh, something built, camped together, something our home constructed, own, our bodies, shelter. The autophage language has a melodic quality to it. The tones are simple and pure, but with a gritty crunch not heard in Korvac's voices. Although my translation is imperfect, I grasp the gist of what they are telling me. This camp is autophage constructed, as are their bodies. Hmm, the guy saying hello next to us. As are their bodies? There we go. Um, hold on. Talk to him. Did something ship disruptor? We blank apologize for the error. Okay, that's for, you know, bringing my ship down. Something is constructed home. There are many like do not have seen as to see. Okay, let's go talk to this one. Uh, hello, disruptor. And welcome among... Okay. He's welcoming us. The Kip has one of many homes across many worlds. Something dissonant worlds are blank. Blank dream in a lattice of purple. Okay. The constructed life form offers me a handful of Atlantid Atlantidium. They handle the substance delicately, reverently, as though it were a priceless heirloom. Take it. Though these beings seem civil enough, I feel a gulf of understanding between them and myself. I should discuss my discovery with priest entity Nada. Perhaps these bar robotic people are known to them. Okay, so now we know what we need to do. So before we head up there, you know what we're gonna do. We're gonna look for a ship. I want a new ship. Hopefully with a little more room in it too, because uh, we're running out of room something serious, seriously fast. Okay. We go that way. There we go. How far? Not far. Hey, cut that out. Journey milestone? What happened? I've met 30 aliens. Ah, gotcha. Okay, well that's nice. Now this is probably another camp. So we'll check this out real quick. 
Again, I want a new ship. That's pretty, pretty much what I'm going to do here, and I'm, I'm going to end up probably selling this one. Oh, check it out. Half in the mountain, half in the mountain there. That happens on occasion. You don't see this too often, folks. And if you carve out the mountain, it will repopulate sooner or later. So we're going to go ahead and head in here. See, everything's kind of in the air. What you can do... There we go. Just take this and clean it up. You'll get a lot of silicone out of it, just to keep in mind. But we do have to clean this all up and make everything appear, or else we're not going to get everything we could possibly get out of this camp. All right. Just make sure I'm not missing something. I don't think there's anything more over here. I think we're done. Uh, let's see. Wasn't there one back here? I guess not. It must have been over there. It's over there. Okay. Alright, so we're good here. Um, yeah, I'll have to just go through the holes a little bit. No big deal. So one, two... Uh, should be one over here, right? Yeah, there's one back there. Okay. Yeah, everything's way off on this one. This is a weird... Uh, weirdly placed thing. A little bit of a glitch going on here. That's okay. Let's gather up all these extra resources. May not always be good stuff, but, you know, it's it's stuff. Okay. In for knives, but yeah, I'll just put that on my ship. Okay, we got void moats. That's good to have. More of that. I'm gonna get rid of this. We don't need it. That just gave us something. We're gonna get rid of that. That gave us a suspicious, suspicious movement module. Let's put this over here temporarily and let's see what it is. 239. Nice. With a 28 sprint recovery, 25% fuel efficiency, and 2 boost. It's not as much of an initial boost, but it is definitely better in other areas. 230 recharge rate, 29. Okay, well you, let me just put you over here, so I can take a look at your real settings. 219, 18 recharge rate, 6, and 20, 47% recovery. So what would that do to this one? Let's see. Wow. 60 sprint recovery time. Eighty-four percent sprint recovery. So that's a pretty good module right here. Um, this one is okay. This one is good too. I like the recharge rate on this one being thirty percent. You know what? I'm going to get rid of this one. This one is really good under two thirty-nine. So it's got a higher jetpack tank, so we can go further with it. Sprint recovery is not going to be as good, but almost as good. So we'll go ahead and keep that. All right. So that's good. This can go over into there. This can go over into there. Cactus flesh. Yeah, I remember getting that. Can we put it in our ship? No, no room. Okay. While we're here, use it and get rid of the rest. We already got 500 over here. We don't need that all that much. All right, we're in good shape. So how's this look? We got some more nanites out of it. Let's use up some more while we're at it, right? Okay, good. All right, so we're good there. Um... We want to go to the computer here. We'll check out the multi-tool, of course. You know, this it's a be halfway decent one. I go to input, and I get back out so I can get here to scan, and it pulls it up immediately. So we got 11, 16, and 6. Uh, 6. 11. And then 16. So, multi-tool. Okay, that's done. Deactivated. We'll go back in, and this time we're going to look for the ship. Oh, we can exchange void. So, we can do this. We can redeem these right now. And that's all I'm allowed to do. So, I'm going to go ahead and redeem them. But in order to get anything else, it's going to we need we need void modes, which we do not have yet. But it looks like I can redeem all of these. Um, you know what? It's probably because my main gameplay has all this. 
So I'm going to just go ahead and redeem them just to get them out of the way. Because I like that. So we're going to go ahead and do it. It's just, it's all facade. It's all just your appearance and that's it. So. And later on we can get these modules and add them to our exosuit as we get more upgrades. Anyway, uh, to our exosuit. Good. Uh, do we have anything to sell? Oh, we can sell everything we want. Excellent. Is there anything I want to get rid of right now? Magna Gold, it can go. Uh, let's see. Walker Brains. I'm going to go ahead and sell about half of those. Oh, crap. I was trying to lower the amount. It. Well, that didn't work. Huh. Okay. Well, I don't know what I did wrong there. That was weird. And which sucks, because I really wanted the Walker Brains. I want to put a combat computer in here. Uh, okay, well, that's a mistake. I'll move on. I'm not going to reload in order to get anything back here. Um, is there anything I can get rid of here? Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get rid of this. I don't need it. Just to give myself, 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 to give myself a little room in here. All right, good. All right, so, oh, and I forgot to look for the ship. Because the void moats jumped in. All right, uh, staff assembly, which we don't have anything. Dissonant spikes. Let's go ahead and do that. So we can get a new ship. Hopefully a more decent one. So the ship we have is a C-class ship. I'd like to be get at least an A-class if I can find one. Because that would help me greatly. So we'll be heading over there in just a moment. Let's check our... our oh, hi there. I didn't see you there. All, all you guys showed up, huh? That's very nice. I'll talk. Uh, we can present a gift. Okay, good deal. That gives us a standing. That'll go up a little bit. We can't offer assistance yet, but we can practice language. And I'm going to request, and then I'm going to go ahead and just get a symbol. Because it's nice to have an extra word from their language, you know. I'm not trying to, sorry, excuse me. Wasn't trying to do that. There we go. So what do we got in here? Yeah, it's a C-class. Not worth anything really right now. So I'll look for something. I want something a little bit better than that anyway. And the Atlantid multi-tools are much better than, than these. These are really, really good. Don't get me wrong, but yeah. What about you? Real quick. Um, let's practice the language. I just want to get some more language skills done. There we go. Yeah, we'll just get more symbols. And one more guy. It's all really, really weird over here. A lot of language. And dialect. Okay, and there we go. Okay, so we got a few words out of it. Alright, our ship is over here. Get around all this stuff. There we go. On our way. Let's go check it out. I'm assuming words. Nope, 35 aliens. Okay. Uh, how far away is it? I didn't catch that. Three minutes. Okay. Looks like we're going to go up and over. We'll go ahead and get this. So this is kind of cool that we're getting all this right now. Because this will give us an opportunity to get a bunch of good things. Oh, hello. It didn't lock in for me, but that's okay. We bought it in time. Um, nice, cool ship. Hopefully we'll get a nice ship that we can start really moving around the solar system with. We'll move all the upgrades over and everything like that. So we got we got some things to do. What I have to remember with these brains that we get out of the computers is I should really have done all the um, stuff with it. You know, the gotten it harmonized and then put it in my inventory. But, you know, it is what it is. Like I said, this is a really cool looking ship. I kind of like it better than the one we've got. So, hopefully it's a nice one. It's a B-class. That's a little bit better. I would like an A-class. Well, let's see what we got. See, we should take the, the high line brain and we should, you know, do something with it. But we should at least harmonize it. So, I'm going to go ahead and do that. There should be nothing over here we need. This autophage might have something in its inventory. Yeah. Alright, so what I'll do is I'll cancel the salvage, because it's not worth it, and we'll see if we can get to one more. We have one, one more echo locator, or two? Three. We have three of them. So we'll go a little quicker at the next one, okay? We're not going to go crazy with this.
Is it that way? Is this it? Isn't this the one we just came from? No, there's another one, right? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Is it taking me to the same exact place again? That would sink. We'll find out in a moment, I guess. But the problem is, is that we're gonna have to actually land there in order to... You know, look for another one. Yeah, it's the same one. I don't believe it. What a... What a crock. Alright, so we're gonna have to do it from over here. Okay. Alright, let's try it one more time. Hopefully it doesn't choose the same one I'm standing at, because that would be a waste. So we have two more opportunities. How far away is that one? Okay, it's not far away by foot. So we should be able to go there pretty quick. <laughs> and through the trees. Very good. First try. All right. So here we go. Now, is this one of the camps I've been to as well, which would also really stink? It looks like it might be. Is it going to just bounce me back and forth between these two camps? Yeah, it is. It's the same camp. I don't believe this. Alright, let's see how unfortunate I will get here. So this will be the last one I can use, right? If it sends me back to the same one I was at before, we're going to be in trouble here. I don't believe it. I think it did. It did. Ten minutes away, right? No, 40 minutes. Okay, so that's further away. This might be our last chance here. My shields haven't recharged yet. So that is... 40 seconds away. Is it, did it really take me to the same place? Ah, what a waste. If it is, it's a waste. I think it is. There's a volcano right there, but... No. No, it is a different one. Okay, I think we got fortunate here. We have one more chance at a decent ship. I probably should have held on to the other salvage for the B-class one, but... Who knows, maybe we'll get fortunate here. Yeah, we got we got good stuff here. Let's go ahead and grab it. And I'm gonna go ahead and do this while we go. Oh, that's good to know. Ooh, a defense chit. That's good. We'll hang on to that, and I'll hang on to that too. Residual goop. Yay. I could I could, you know, do something with it, but I'm not going to. Alright, get rid of that, let's get rid of that. And yeah, I'll just dismantle it and get something out of it. I'm gonna go ahead and use the salvage glass. We've got Sentinel Exosuit Skeleton upgrade. We'll go ahead and add it. Shield strength, okay. Well, that's alright. There. That'll help me a little bit. Uh I guess we'll hang on to that for now. I don't know. We'll see. Let's go ahead and unlock this thing and get our ship. Come on. Yep, I know. Um, let's see. 14, 3, and 9. Okay. Uh, 9. And then 14. Uh, where are you here? 14. Okay, good. We'll unlock the multi-tool. We'll go back in. It'll unlock everything else, and we'll get the dissonant spikes. Hopefully find us a different ship. Okay. So this is our last chance, because we don't have any more of those things. And like I said, I'm not going to glitch any. And it looks like it is a different one. Okay, good. Let's check out the tool. What do we got? 
Oh, it's an A-class. Fabulous. Couple of, uh... Supercharged slots, so it is damaged, but I will take this. Uh, although we can only exchange, it says. Okay, so that means we have too many wealthy tools. Let's just check our inventory here. Do -do -do. Okay, that's the one I'm using right now. That's the Poem of Clarity and the Poem of Night. Which, if I'm not mistaken, this is actually a Atlanted multi-tool. It is. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna hang on to that. Somehow I don't recall getting it. I must be losing it. Hey, Poem of Clarity. What do you like? You're a B-class. Bullcaster. Got an advanced mining laser on board. We'll go ahead and keep that one. Because, you know, it costs in order to get it. Uh, yeah, okay. We'll take the ricochet, ricochet module. What else we got? We got the bolt caster itself. I'll go ahead and put that in here. Again, we don't have to build it now. Mining beam is good. Scanner good. Analysis visor. Okay, good. And again, it had two slots as well. But, you know, I'd like to go ahead and just get this tool anyway. Pair. Exchange. All right. So we do have an Atlantid multi-tool now. Not an Atlantid. Pardon me. A Sentinel multi-tool now. We just have to repair this, and we need a crystallized heart to do it. Um... So, it's good to have this. I'll hang on to it for now. I'm going to switch back to my other multi-tool for the time being. Let me just check something out real quick. The gravity engine, what is it like? Yeah, we're going to go ahead and do this one next time. So, now we know. Okay. Back to our theoretical arc injector. Which is our greatest weapon at the moment. Okay. And we're going to head over here and head over to that ship and check it out. All right, get somewhere, get somewhere. Please be a decent ship. I mean, you don't... What? Um, okay, that was really weird. 268,000 kilometers. But now it's saying it's like right in our backyard. Say 197 KS? That's weird, I haven't seen that before. It is literally on the other side of the planet, though. And... Wow, okay, a little mountainous here. Whoop, slow down. Alright. Please, pray tell, be a nice ship. I mean, I'll settle for a B-class, but I would really like an A. It's a C. Oh my gosh. Ah, uh, okay. So what we're gonna do... I will take what's in here. Uh, we have the Highline Brains. I'm going to go ahead and take this. I'm really disappointed. I should have gotten that B-Class one. I really like this ship, and it's pretty. And we have to harmonize the brain, so we might as well get it. I will continue to look, because we're going to have to get some inverted mirrors and stuff like that. Okay. I'm, I'm going to forget this ship, too, so we're not going to bother with it. What a sucky thing to happen. It is what it is. Okay. So, again, we need some other stuff. We will get it as we go. I need crystallized stuff. So I'm going to find a building and maybe get into one more battle. Uh, let's go with... Oh, I've got plenty of Pugnium. I'll go ahead and use it. So we need a, a place that has a building. So I can duck in and I can fight these uh, sentinels a little bit easier. Well, oh, it's taking me to Priest Entity Nada. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's just continue the storyline for one more moment and we'll come back. I'll look for a building. I'll get into a little bit of a sentinel fight. See if we can find ourselves another echo locator or two. And you know, I might actually do some of this off-camera, so that I can find this stuff. And I promise I won't cheat. I'm not in the mood to cheat on this one. This is a very straightforward playthrough. We are not cheating or glitching or anything like that. We have... how many of those theoretical arc injectors? We have another one. Interesting. And it's damaged... Interesting. 
Okay, well, cool. So we can get rid of that one, too. Uh, Dream Entangler. What's this one? I haven't even... Yeah, there's nothing on here I would want either. So there's a couple of these things I can get rid of. So you know what? You guessed it. We can use this. Let everything build in. We haven't been up here yet. Let's go ahead and get rid of that one. There's no reason to keep it. We're just going to get some uh, money for them. Then a couple of things. Including a multi-tool expansion slot. Looks like we got one. And... Rather than trade them... Now this one we said we were going to get rid of too. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh, okay. We already got it selected. Let's just check it. Make sure it's the one I want to get rid of. It is. So we'll get rid of this one too. I don't get anywhere near as much money for it, but... We could... Ah, go figure. Yeah, yeah, no kidding, my inventory's full. Um, get rid of those. Got a lot of stuff in here now, don't, don't you think? Don't you know? Yeah, yeah, look at all that. Good grief. I gotta sell some of this stuff off. A sentinel weapons shard. Ah, I can't put it anywhere. We'll put you in there. Now, where'd it go? Over here, right? Okay, that's not bad. 40-48. 40-54. Okay, we'll put you over there. It'll it'll make it a little more powerful. So this gives us a little bit more room. Uh, what else can we get rid of? Why is this here? Can't, don't we have Pugnium on the ship? Yes, we do. Alright, that gives us a little extra room as well. And what about these? Don't we have this on the ship? Yes, we do. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Okay, so, back to the, that, and we'll get rid of this one, too. Um, why is it worth one million? It's a C-class, there's nothing on it. Probably, maybe it's because of all the slots, who knows. Alright, I just wanted to make sure I wasn't messing something up here. That was really weird. Alright, there's another multi-tool expansion slot, another mining beam module. Good. So what they and do they stack? I think they do. Yes, they do. Good. Alright, no, we don't want to get rid of that just yet. What's our next tool? So what is that? That's the Bayer Silencer, and that's the one we just got. Okay, so that's the one we use now. This is Palm of the Night, which is one of the Atlantid ones, and our other theoretical arc injector. Which, um, we're going to get rid of. Now, this one is interesting. I don't know what this is going to give us. Is it's going to give us money? Yeah, it is. Okay. We're going to go ahead and get rid of it. All right. Good. And another mining beam module. This time we got a scanning module, too. Oof. I'm a little, little full over here. So, uh, let's get rid of the... There. I just want to make sure I have enough room for everything. And while we're here, let's go and get rid of that. We're going to put the 150 in here so we can get that. And we'll put a little extra in. Uh, where'd it go? There. Okay, now we have one more extra slot. And we're not getting rid of any more multi-tools. So, whoop, get over there. Come on, you can do it. I wonder if we can make it. And... We did. Ha <laughs> ha. Alright, Nada, what do you have to say? He not as happy to see Traveler Friend again, but Traveler Friend looks full with news. We tell him about the autophagia. Out of the harmonic camp, not as abandoned as it first appeared. I tell them of its electronic inhabitants, these cloaked autophage, and their melodic language. So similar to Corvax, yet quite distinct. Not as very quiet as they listen. When I finish speaking, they remain so quiet and so still that I wonder if they have forgotten I am standing here. They are difficult to read sometimes. Finally, they speak. Nada wonders. They trail off, shaking their head. No, Nada will not wonder. Nada will understand. Our data is insufficient to know if this pattern is familiar. Yet, also, Nada thinks of terminal echoes, thinks Apollo's echo construct, construct, thinks of older stories before Nada's divergence. Nada cannot help it. They are just thoughts. We should try to understand builder entities. Echo construct may know this pattern better than Nada. 
Okay. Now we're getting somewhere, right? Now remember, we haven't completed the storyline yet. We're waiting for an update from Hello Games to give us the rest of our storyline. So we're going to see what happens here. The odd-looking construct writhes excitedly, their facial tubes swaying. They fix all five eyes upon me. Here, Shell feels her. at show Atlantidium. Here, Shell is... I... I... Oh, her. All shells know this crystal. All electronic hearts know her. Void, 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 void. Ask about the autophage. I... Yes, I know them. Built others. No entity deserves erasure. They have built their own. I am content here. I am home. Acceptance of no answers. Built others are different. They look for her. Built others respect sturdy hands. Hands that build. Meet them where they are. Knowledge through friendship. Friendship through trust. Ask about the construct. I, I, I am construct. Assembled here by polo hands and by your hands, other entity. I was made here, but I remember before here, before assembly, a mind is not a body, a mind remembers. I, I remember, built others on quiet wavelength, only a whisper, long distance trace difficult. Other entity, take this memory, build it to hear them louder, except the blueprint. So we got a polyphonic core. So that's how we find everything now. So it requires Atlanta DM, quantum computer, and living glass. Whoosh. That's going to take some doing, too, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, let's see here. So we want a computer. Hold on, where is it? I thought we had that. We do not have that. Wow. Okay. So we need that. And we need living glass. Don't we have living glass? I thought we did. Maybe we've got... Yeah, there it is. Requires lubricant and glass. Lubricant's a pain in the neck to get, let me tell you. Uh, Fecium and Gamma Roots, see? Um, so, we probably... This is going to take some time to build that. Um, so that's going to be our next thing to do. And we'll go on a quest to get all that stuff. Oh, wait a minute. It's sending us over here to talk to Nada. Again. Let's go talk to Nada real quick. Did Polo Friends Project wake? Do they live? Say they spoke in autophage. Hmm, they are an entity. They have a self, but whatever their voice, Nada does not think they are a builder entity any more than Nada is. Ask about, tell about the blueprint. Impressive. Traveler entity is fast to gain construct entity's trust. This is a useful memory print. Ask about her. Here we go. Brand entity, I am sorry. If Nada understands construct entity's meaning, Nada does not wish to discuss it. So we discuss the next steps. Nada's opinion is limited, but Nada will share what they have. Build their entities value this purple lattice. Construct entity, construct entity responds. Even Nada's carapace, carapace responds. Other electronics may respond too. And build their entities do not seem dangerous. Data comes from time together. Friendship may too. It is traveler entity's choice. Both are valid. It is not either or. Leave. Okay, so we're done with that. So we have some work to do. Prayers of the Machine. So that is going to be our next on the They Who Return. So we have to expand our investigation. Prayers to the Machine and Audience with, with the Autophage is our next two things that we have to do. I don't think we have to talk to anybody else here, right? Yeah, we're good. Okay, we're good. Let's move on. Okay, so we are going to do... The next best thing, we'll spend the last couple moments going through a quick sentinel battle because we need stuff. I need some hearts, I need some other things, so we're going to find myself a um, building that I can build in. That I can, pardon me, that I can, well, not really build, I don't think that's the right word, that we can uh, hide in. Hide is a good word, we'll use the word hide. Uh, looks like we got a building over here. Is it a regular building, or is it just one of those little mini campsites? Uh, just a campsite. Okay, move on. Another one here. Did we just find a camp? No, no, no. Ooh, that... Yeah, this is perfect. This will work. 
Ooh, we can get into a nice sentinel, sentinel battle here. This will be good. A little dark at the moment. That's okay. All right, let's head inside for a moment. Check, check things out. First thing we want to do is grab whatever things are here that we can use. Uh, what's over here? What? I can't even see it. Oh, that's why it's buried in there. Yeah, that's funny. Don't need anything out of there. All right, so we have the right multi-tool, correct? Is that what we got? Let's see. We're going to use Theoretical Arc Injector. And we need to check it real quick. What is that? Why is that damaged? Oh, that's right. We haven't found, we haven't gotten deuterium yet. We have to go back to our home base to do that. So I'm not going to worry about it just yet. Um, yep, this is it. Okay, do we have ammunition? We do. I'm going to go ahead. Uh, I don't think we have the advanced mining laser. We do. Uh, we don't have any room in our starship either, do we? Yeah. And we want everything pretty much in here. We have weapon shards in here. We just haven't put them on our... I'm going to get rid of some things here. I think it's time. Problem is, I don't know what to get rid of. Let's get rid of these. They're only worth 60 a piece anyway. So I'm going to go ahead and delete them. That'll give us at least a little bit more room so I can drop some stuff out of this inventory and into there. Okay. I want the nanites out of this, so I'm going to get as much as I can out of it while I can. Let's get rid of the scanner module and the bolt caster module. Those are useless to me. We need to sell these. I think we can sell them here. Let's go ahead and do that. Hi there. And that way we have some inventory space when we gather up the stuff that we need. Let's useful springs. Cogs. Uh, I'll go ahead and get rid of the tainted metal. It's a shame, but there you are. I'm going to keep those. Those are worth gold right now for me. Okay, go back. All right, that gives us a little bit more room. We will hang on to these for the next multi-tool. I guess we can get rid of the silicon, silicate powder. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. All right, it looks like we got some room in here now. So, I guess the bottom line is, shall we? All right. There we go. We're all set. Um, do they have phosphorus in here so we can build up our inventory? No, just ammonia. All right. There's nothing here I can use just at this time. So let's go ahead and get moving here. Boatcaster. And we have some ammunition. I want one more. Uh, where'd it go? That's my ship. Thank you. Yeah, that'll be good. All right, now we just need to find ourselves a sentinel to annoy. Hmm. Well, to discuss the wildlife uh, or discover the wildlife where we're here. Really, that far away, and we can see him through the hill, huh? Okay, interesting. I don't see any sentinels just yet. I want to discover some creatures, so I'm going to go to the edge of the hill here. We'll take another look. I know one way we can get we can attract them. We got all these gravitino balls here. Oh, there's one. How many is that? Five of ten. Okay, we'll have to hold off on the rest. Because we're about to piss somebody off. Hey, buddy. Careful, they have flames. I forgot about that. So we're going to go up here, and that should hopefully offer us a little bit more protection.
Yep, there's those flames I was talking about. But if we can keep him occupied, I can get stuck. Ah. Come on, take him out. Thank you. I think he knows about the light post. What do you think? Let's get healed up. Okay. Let's go this way with this. Them this oh, that's why I was stuck. Okay. Now, if they heal it... They are healing it. Got him. Where'd he go? Waiting for them to launch, start launching bombs at me. Okay. This worked out. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Where'd those guys come from? Whoa, 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 whoa. Cut that out. None of that from you, buddy. We're already damaged. Oh, crap. Got him. Now, I need to go inside and heal up. Where'd they go? They're over there. Just for a moment. Let's go ahead and fix. Not my ship. I don't want my ship fixed. Come on. Um, what got damaged? I don't see anything broken. Oh, there it is. There we go. Oh, there he is. And they can't attack me while I'm up here, so that's the thing. So let's go up higher and find out where these other little guys are. There he is. go. Alright. That's good. Who's next? Somebody else, right? Isn't there another one someplace? I think he's down here. There he is. Okay. Swarm is hunting. Oh boy. Okay, well here we go. Uh, can't get through here. See, can I go all the way up? Yeah, I can. Ugh. Now I can't get him. Because he's too low. Oh, that was rude. Well, you go heal now. There we go. <sighs> can't wait to get an Atlantic multi-tool with that nice laser. Because that'll help this out a lot. There, I got him. Not before he got me. Where's all the rest of them? Ooh, wow. 
pretty good shots. I mean, I could dodge it and everything like that. All right, Swarm is hunting, so I don't know... I think I'm gonna... I don't think he's gonna find me in 18 seconds. Hmm, okay. Detected. Come on over. Oh, that hurt. Oh, 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 I forgot they could do that. Oh. That's why those planets that have the good gravity, gravity waves. Where'd he go? Gives me another heart. Anybody else? Multiplying. Okay, good. Get back over here. Get them from that direction. Oh, there's two of them. I'm going to go all the way up this time. And hope that we don't have any of the other guys. healers, that is. Because he'll try to launch stuff at me even while I'm up here. Usually. Nice. Okay, thermal protection's falling. And gone. Okay. That'll at least occupy one of them. Got him. Come on, reload. Oh, wow. That was a long reload time, my friend. There we go. Okay, good. Done with that. What can I do for you guys? I am being hammered here. Ooh. There we go. Whoa, watch him. Still shooting stuff at me, my friend. Come on, I've got you. Ah! I knew he was going to get that last one off. So this will get me a ship, too, as a matter of fact. So this will be a good thing. And then what I'll do is I'll go look for that ship when I... When I get done. And I'll do that off camera. Hopefully we'll get a good one. Okay, we're done over here? I think we're done over here. Who's next? Can I fix this? That's the ship. I need a carbon nanotube again, and I need... What was it? I need more oxygen, and I don't have it. Okay, where do they go? It says over there. Okay, they are coming. Whoever they are. Got him. 
Who? What swarm? There's nobody else. I got one more over there. Okay, hopefully this is it. I think this is all of them. I think I got him. There's another one down here. Are you kidding me? This is level... Oh, it's a level 4? I thought it was level 5. Oh, got it. Okay, good. Good, good, good. So we're done. Done with the battle. Okay, so we got ourselves a ship now we can take a look at. And I am blown away by this. So this is going to be a pretty long episode. It looks like I got a volcano or... No, it's a worm. Hi, worm. Uh, what other... Do I have any more combat stuff floating around? Let me just check real quick. I don't think we do. I think I got it all. Yeah, I think we got it all. Okay, we're in good shape. Uh, how's my inventory look? Let's take a look at that. Okay, we got one echolocator in here too, so that's good. We got an extra echo echolocator. We got plenty of crystallized hearts. We need oxygen, something bad. So I am just going to do a quick scan. We're going to look for some oxygen. There's a bunch over there. Let's go ahead and grab some real fast. Ah, oh, we got these guys here. That's good. Good. Let's get some more. Excellent. Plenty of oxygen from those guys. I like those. Any more of those around? I could use some more. Uh, I don't see any. Doesn't mean they're not there. There's one. Got it. <laughs> Alright, that should give me a good amount of oxygen, am I right? Good, 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 good. Always a pressure. Alright. Okay, so that should help me out greatly. I'm going to get... Uh, Get my repair going on my on myself real fast. Uh, let me get this fixed, and we'll make the one carbon nanotube. And there we go. We're all fixed up. Excellent. All right, no problems. And then we're gonna go and check out the ship, and we'll land and check it out, and then you'll get a preview of what we're gonna do, and we'll call this episode an end, and we'll continue on with the autophage. And see what else we can discover. So we're we're looking at a whole lot of a uh, lot of stuff that I have only done like one time. We did it a little bit during the expedition that had come out at the time, but I've only done this one time on my main save. So I'm not, or I did it actually. I have two main saves, so I did it a second time as well. I just don't remember it because it's been so long. So let me see what kind of ship we're going to end up with here. And let's just hope for at least a B class, okay? We just need an upgrade from what we've got, and then we're good. We're good to go. Wow, okay, talk about buried on a hillside here. Is this the same ship? That would be amazing if it was. Would you just land already and stop giving me a bunch of baloney? That would be amazing if it turned out to be the same ship. It is, it's the same ship. I, I guarantee it. Nope. No, not the same ship, but a similar ship as well. I'm going to go ahead and take those, and I'm going to leave the Highland Brain. I don't need any more of those anymore. And what do you have for me? Anything in your inventory? Just more Pugnium. Okay, we'll take it. Okay, and that should do it. So, folks, I'm going to go on another ship hunt, and I'm going to go look for some more stuff. And what we're going to do is then um, basically call this 
done for today. And if you have any questions, by all means, put them in the comments section. Please hit the like and subscribe. And we will see you folks in the next video. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.